recent report by the Central Groundwater Board CGWB reveals that 440 districts across India have high nitrate levels in their groundwater with 20% of the samples exceeding the permissible limit. This number has increased from 359 districts in 2017. The report highlights that nitrate contamination is a significant environmental and health concern, particularly in agricultural regions using nitrogen-based fertilizers and animal waste. High nitrate levels can cause health issues like blue baby syndrome in infants and are unsafe for drinking. The environmental implications are even more alarming. When nitrates from groundwater contaminate lakes and ponds, they trigger devastating algal blooms that choke the life out of aquatic ecosystems. Rajasthan, Karnataka and Tamil Nadu have reported over 40% of samples exceeding the permissible limit, while Maharashtra, Telangana, Andhra Pradesh and Madhya Pradesh have also shown high contamination levels. In contrast, Arunachal Pradesh, Assam, Goa, Meghalaya, Mizoram and Nagaland have reported all samples within safe limits. The CGWB has identified 15 districts as the most affected by high nitrate levels including Barmer and Jodhpur in Rajasthan and other districts in Maharashtra, Telangana, Tamil Nadu and Punjab. The report attributes high nitrate levels to excessive irrigation, poor management of animal waste, urbanization and population growth. Additionally, the report notes that fluoride concentrations exceeding the permissible limit are a major concern in Rajasthan, Haryana, Karnataka, Andhra Pradesh and Telangana. Elevated arsenic levels have also been found in several states, particularly in the flood plains of the Ganga and Brahmaputra rivers. The report emphasizes that states with overexploited groundwater blocks are more likely to have excessive chemical contaminants. While India has a robust system for monitoring groundwater health, efforts are needed to get states to act on these findings and contain the crisis.